and welcome back to Let's Play Half May Hero. Well, let's start Half not Half May Hero. Let's start Evil Lord 30. We already did Hero 30, and this is our Evil Lord. Remember him? We technically didn't. No wait, no, we didn't kill him in this playthrough of uh, Hero 30. But his name is Evil Lord because I say so. And he is fabulous. <coughs> yep, that happened in Hero 30. Also, uh, what was it? Evil Lord 30 takes place 100 years after Hero 30. So just remember that. Since, uh, Hero 30 was in Goddess Era 100. Now it's got us here at 200. And now we're going to follow our new hero. As soon as he shows up. Say hello to Evil Lord. He is fabulous. Also, he really likes the color purple. <gasps> How does a monster grow a flower? Monster bath thing grow a flower? Whatever, let's just kill him. No, actually, you know what? Explain it to me. I'm kind of rusty on uh, Evil Lord 30. Basically, Evil Lord 30 is a giant RTS game. It's based on rock, paper, scissors. Brutes beat nimble types, nimble types beat range types, and range types beat brutes. Yeah, Rochambeau is another name for rock, paper, scissors. Now the thing about Evil Lord 30 is it's kind of simple. Honestly, all you really have to do, also the, that circle around Evil Lord, that's basically mana. The fuller it is, the stronger monsters you'll summon. So basically all you really need to do is spam a single type of monster usually, and then hold X to make them charge. That's a charge. Go, oh, my pretties! Why is there a mole here? When did I summon a mole? Oh, well, we need more monsters. <gasps> but yeah, I won. Somehow. Also, that's what Millennia looks like. Does it really look like her sprite? But unfortunately, she can't go out in the day. Also, for some reason, uh, Evil Lord only goes seems to go out when there's only 30 seconds of night left. It's kind of weird. But anyways, Evil Lord 30 is pretty simple to be honest. I'm not a huge fan of it. But anyways, let's head off to stage two. Yeah, he's kind of obsessed about the whole beauty thing. Well, that's just rude. Also, rocking music. Shut up. Um, okay, what the hell did money I get? Hint. Yep, these are brutes. Basically, we need range spiders. Okay. Alright, so basically spam shooters. Got it. Also, now we have a time limit. So, make sure we, uh... 
should finish this before 30 seconds hit. Because we can't stay out once the sun comes out. But it's okay, we're done already. It's so hideous, it must die. Lord would be over a hundred years old at this point. Technically, the Evil Lord is still around, too. And we got the rank Beautiful Evil Lord. Yes, all the ranks are like that. Anyways, off to the path. Shut up, woman. I know where I'm going. I just love the Evil Lord's dialogue sometimes. He's such a hopeless romantic. Yeah, she's basically explaining that the bigger the circle around you is, the stronger monsters you'll summon. But if you get hit, it shrinks, so be careful of that. Oh, evil lord. Anyways, we're gonna summon a bunch of brutes. Actually, no, shooters would be better. Never mind. We're just gonna summon a bunch of shooters. And then hold X. Yeah, this mode tends to be chaotic. And not in the good way, either. There we go. And there's one more guy up here. Yes, I know there are 10 seconds left. Shut up. Whoops. Okay. Also, I don't know why he uses Millennia as an umbrella. Oh, we're only a gorgeous evil lord. We didn't finish the stage fast enough. Now I'm sad. We aren't beautiful. Mm. Anyways, off to the next, one, next stage. Yeah, this mode goes by a lot faster than Hero 30. You look familiar. Okay, never mind. She isn't even trying to hide her identity. She's just wearing sunglasses for some reason. Sure, why not? But yeah, the time glass appears in all of the game modes. I already did that. You don't have to explain it. But yeah, since her statues are kind of gone a hundred years in the future, she's kind of taken residence somewhere else. She's living in the barrel right now. I don't know why. Bye, time goddess. But yeah, basically all you have to do is touch the statue and as long as you have any money at all, she'll rewind time for you. Wait, why am I screwed? I want shooters. There we go. And now, also it's getting really light for the middle of the night. But yeah, now enemies will start dropping money. Oh crap, I'm actually taking damage. I'm gonna get some more time. Excuse me. There we go. Also, whenever you get more time, you get full of healing too. So, let's destroy some houses. I said let's destroy- there you go, buddy. No, guys, go over there. No, attack the statue. Attack. Okay, fine. That's the other thing about this uh, game mode. It's really chaotic. And it's hard to control your, your uh, minions sometimes. All you can really do is come to charge. Also, I really should get more time. There we go. Whoops, these guys aren't. They're nimble. They're not brutes. That means summon a ton of brutes against them. There we go. And now let's destroy this destroy the statue. There you go. Yep, 
Evil Lord, you're over a hundred years old. You should know what a king is. Okay. But yeah, from now on, uh, whatever money you have left over will be given to Millennia. And that's basically how you level up in this game mode. Also, every time you touch the uh, barrel, she takes all of your money. And when she takes all of your money, because she's greedy. Anyways, off to the fort. We're already on stage 5. Even more, get your face away from the bow. Also, archers! We're gonna need nimbles. Let me guess, you're gonna tell me I need nimbles. Yep. Also, yeah, we should destroy those cannons too. Alright, let's do this. Alright, first I need to charge up my magic. Get a crap ton of nimbles on my side. They also only last a certain amount of time. And then have them charge. I need more. Also, I don't know why it gets so light, considering it's supposed to be the middle of the night. Oh, crap. No, get off me. Get rid of that. Yeah, the thing about the uh, cannons is they can stun you. Which is bad. Also, there are a shit ton of archers here. Let's take care of them. There we go. I don't know what that achievement is for, but we only got a pretty evil lord. But on the other hand, we s we're sexier. Yes, our level is based completely on how sexy the evil lord is. I do not want to know how he summons all of these uh, monsters. It's with his penis. Minister Ugly Face. Sure, why not? Let me guess, you're just gonna explain those are... Okay. You're gonna explain those are brutes. Oh, wait, I don't remember this. That's right, you can summon a... Uh... Or you can recruit wild monsters if there are any around. Okay. Oh, let's beat up Mr. Ugly Face. Alright, first things first. Let's get some mammoths. They are now in love with me. And they're going to murder everything. Also, if you notice, we have a shit ton more mana now. Oh. He's dead. Whoops. I don't want a fabulous floor sum with you. But yeah, that went by a lot quicker than I thought it would. But anyways, there's a branching path here now. These four, uh, these four uh, stages are completely optional. So we're gonna do one of them. Basically by being these stages, we get new types of monsters. And new summons. Alright, let's go some hunters. You're with me. You're with me. Am I recruiting help? I guess I am. I might not be high enough level for this, actually. Oh, we know there's a time gosh shop here. Let's get some more time. 
wait for my mana to charge up, and start spamming Brute, or not Brute, Nimble. That is basically all the strategy you need for these type of, or for these levels. Spam whichever monster is super effective. Wait, why aren't you, no, kill them, thank you. I think we're almost done. Yeah, there are only a few uh, guys left. In fact, there's only one left. And now he is dead. Well, that was awkward. Anyways, let's keep going on this stage. Chain. Oh, he will be. All we've got to do is beat the crap out of him. First thing first, let's recruit us some monsters. That's a giant octopus. And now he's my friend. And now, like always, spam nimbles and kill all the archers. Uh, where are the rest? Uh, actually, let's go free him first. We should get brutes to clear the rocks. Hey, buddy. Wow, that's going to be direct. You don't want to be a fabulous foursome. Basically, now we have a special skill we can find in battle. If we see any of the uh, fabulous foursome on the stage, we go up to them and hit R. But anyways, now we've recruited the water for. I don't know what to call them. I'm guessing. I'm just gonna call them summons. Because Fabulous Foursome is kind of a tongue twister. Let's go this way now. And we have Lumberjacks. Evil Lumberjacks. Actually, that's true. You can't talk to trees. But anyways, Lumberjacks! That means spam shooters. Also evil apples are on my side for some reason. Odd. Also we are kinda killing a bunch of trees. Uh, where are the rest of them? They're up there. Let's go take care of them. Hey, no guys, go hit the lumber- hit the Lumberjacks! Hit the I need more time. Yeah, the AI of your monsters isn't always the best. Like right now, they can't shoot something two feet in front of them. No, guys, 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 no, he's not even moving. There you go. Technically, we kind of killed a bunch of trees there. Whoops. Anyways, let's go recruit the forest spirit. Aw, she's sensitive. <coughs> you don't want to know what a fabulous foursome is. But anyways, let's go save her. With a bunch of shooters. Also, you can only- I forgot, you can only command monsters inside of your circle. After, oh my god, they have a lot of reinforcements. Nibbles! To me! Nimbles, do your work. Nimbles, do better! Nimbles, you suck. Alright, oh wait, let's actually summon some monsters to protect me. Don't wanna go- oh my god. Don't wanna go in there unprepared. Hey, lady! That was easy. And then we forcibly recruit her. Aww, we made her cry. 
the evil lord's kind of a jerk. Anyways, I think that's enough for this episode. We kind of finished like a third of the mode already. So next time on Let's Play Half Man Hero, we continue recruiting our fabulous foursome. I don't like that phrase. <laughs> <laughs>